All right, everybody. Welcome to 24 Slayton. I'm Tim. I'm Jordan. All knowing. I talked to Kiki, Kiki today, and she said yes, all knowing. I'm all knowing. Yeah, she said that. <laughs> so. Why am I all knowing? Because you're all knowing. Dude, the only people that call me that are you, whoever else is in this podcast, and TN. There you go. See? That's all you need. It's it's facts. It's facts. Okay. Facts. So what's up, George? I haven't talked to you in a while. You've been um what have you been doing? You've been um traveling the world. The world? Yeah. You're traveling the world. The world. Yes. I have not left the United States. You're traveling the world all over the place just doing crazy Jordan things. I have not left the United States. You did. You went to Canada. No, I yeah. didn't go to Canada. You went through Canada. You went over Canada. No, no. You go. You go from Seattle, and you go around. You don't go through Canada. Stop it, flat Earth guy. When you go to Alaska, you went to Canada, dude. You were Canadian for a minute. Canadian for a minute. Yep. Yeah. I've never been to Canada. I'm pretty sure you guys went through Canada. Never been to Canada. On your, on your big trips. Mm -mm. Your big trip. Nope. Okay. No, I just went to, I went to Alaska. How was it? It was a hike. Yeah? It was a hike. It was cool. What'd you see? Went on a, went on a hike. But uh, I went to catch a con. Catch a what? Catch a con. Catch a con, catch a con. Yeah. What you gonna do? <clears throat> no? Yeah. But catch a con is a... Uh, it's like an island, technically right off Hawaii, and not in Hawaii, uh, Alaska. Yeah. But it's part of Alaska. <clears throat> but it's it, it it's like kind of like Alaska. It's like Alaska for bitches, like because they don't got all the. <laughs> That's why you went. Huh? Is that why you went? Yeah, because it's. All the things that you think about Alaska, yeah. a lot of that's not there. So it's not cold? Um, it wasn't that cold. No? Oh, well, I, I can't, I can't stand cold, like, at all. So I'm wearing, like, long sleeve jacket, and, uh, you know, sometimes I have a thermal underneath. Mm hmm but to the actual Alaskan people that were there, it was nice. That was t-shirt weather. What was it? What was this, the? What was the um? Yeah, temperature. Temperature. You know, like good sixty. Oh, that's warm, dude. I know. It's warm. It's not cold though. Huh? That's not cold. It's cold for us. For you, because my play. This place is cold for you. <laughs> this place is cold for me. <laughs> I can't, I can't stand the cold. I'm gonna tell you, buddy. But it was, it was like, if like you're, if if you can't handle a lot of the actual Alaska, and I, like like I feel like that's like that's like um, that's like the beginner track. Okay. Mhm. Mm so what happened? You didn't send no pictures. People were pissed at you. People. Yeah, because you didn't send no pictures. What people? What people are pissed? I'm just saying. You didn't send no. You didn't do pictures. Like you didn't document what you're doing. No, I got pictures. You didn't see them. <laughs> yeah, I know. <laughs> we didn't see them last yeah, no, That's not true. <clears throat> I've got a couple pictures. No, a I couple sent, videos. I sent. I sent pictures to some people. Yeah. Yeah, I just don't post them on social media. You didn't give me any pictures. I didn't see any. You didn't ask. Also, I can't talk about it with anything <laughs> with you, because if I talk about anything with you. Then, you know, it, it, it doesn't say, it's not the same. Oh. <laughs> so what happened? You seen fish? You seen, um, you went fishing? That's only what I know. I seen you fishing. Oh, yeah. I did go fishing. Well, did you go fishing or you watched fishing? I watched fishing. So what, how, how, explain, explain. Okay. I didn't buy a fishing license, so I didn't go fishing. But when I was, we had to hike up to the fishing spot. Mm-hmm. So why don't you buy fishing license and pole? 
Um, I don't know. You don't want to be disappointed, Halloween, Alaska? Yeah, I didn't want to do that. <laughs> okay. Because every time I go fishing, I don't catch anything. This but, could have been your chance, though. Huh? They were there. Yeah. Uh, that was the worst part. So who caught fish? Andrew and Martin caught a fish. See? They, they both caught one. See, you could have caught a fish. No, the, the worst part was... I was looking at the water. <clears throat> and I've been watching a lot of fishing videos now. Dude, <laughs> you started laughing. Go ahead, just come on. <clears throat> I watch a lot of fishing videos now, so now I know like, like better ways on how to fish. And um, <laughs> I, I I look around and I saw, like I see like little things that I know fish like, and I looked around. I was like, ooh, I saw one. Andrew, throw your line right there. Throws it right there. And he's like, oh, I got something. I need help. <laughs> what do you mean need help? Because he never fished before. <laughs> he, he never fished before, and within 10 minutes, he already caught a fish. See, you could have caught a fish, dude. <laughs> I could have. Could have actually caught a fish. I sure have caught a fish, and he caught, he caught a rainbow trout. Nice. Mm-hmm. How big? Uh, it was like a good seven, eight inches. Yeah. Throw it back. Yep. Did you take a picture like this? Yep. Okay. Oh no, Martin held it. That was because <laughs> he's he's too scared to touch the fish. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yep. And then Martin was getting really salty. What, because he didn't catch anything? Because he couldn't catch a fish. And I was I was there, and I was like, well, I'm not fishing, so I want to go check out the rest of the lake. So I hiked around the lake, and I was looking at all kinds of other stuff. And then as soon as I was about to get to the other side... I found another fishing spot. I was like, ooh, found a fishing spot. Told them to go. I went to the second spot. They're like fish everywhere when I was there. And it looked really pretty. So as soon as I told them we should go to that spot, I walked over, told them to go over there. Everything I said there sounded like a lie immediately. Because all the clouds just came in right after couldn't see anything <laughs> like uh, you couldn't see the mountains or anything anymore and you got a picture of it oh i did see so there it is yep and then uh, that's why i said man you guys just ruined my spot and then they also had um uh, like the water got like a little uh what is it a little rumbly like so, like it, like the the surface of it was like a bit more rough, mm -hmm. and uh, fishy fish don't like that. So they fished there for a bit, caught nothing. I walked the other way, and then Martin's like, "I don't like the spot. I'm gonna go back." So he went back to the first spot when we were all gone, and then as soon as we left, I mean, as soon as he went there, he's like. Guys, quick, 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 quick. I got one. And then he caught a fish. So he was like, I'm not going to miss this fish. And <laughs> because by the time we got there, fish was gone. Uh. But he's like, I'm not letting this happen. I'm not letting it happen like, so they could say I didn't catch a fish. So while he was catching it with one hand, mm -hmm. he had the pull on between his legs and cut his phone out. He was recording it while he was catching the fish. And then he uh, recorded it, and then he took a selfie with one. Nice. Mm -hmm. You didn't catch a fish? No, I didn't catch a fish. Okay. Did you eat a fish? I ate a lot of fish. Okay. I ate a lot of salmon. I had 
Oh, I had king crab legs. You see a bear? You pet a bear? No. Oh, that was a thing. <clears throat> Kajakon is an island off Alaska, so all the big Alaska stuff is not there. So, you didn't get to... Um, what were you supposed to do? No. Pet a bear. There's no bears. You're supposed to hang out with a the moose. There's no meese. No meeses. What's the other one you're supposed to do? And there are no wolves. No wolves. <sighs> Penguin? That's too not, far. Too far? Oh my god. Did you, see, did, you, did you at least see a Canadian hockey player? Maybe? Nope. <laughs> Dude. That's disappointing. No one. I don't think I got a single sorry. No sorries? No, no sorry. So what about the, um, um, did you eat Tim Hortons at least? Isn't that big up there? No, that's Canada. Oh, yeah, it's Canada. Canada. Damn. So what'd you do? Blubber? Do you eat blubber? No. No. <laughs> oh my God. How'd you go to Alaska and do, do Alaska things? <laughs> No, we did Alaska things. It was just it was missing a lot of the Alaska things. Did you eat Mexican food? No. No Chinese food. We ate Filipino food <laughs> for one day. Oh, but surprisingly, because like we uh, we yelped mm -hmm. to see like what the locals like to eat there. They like Filipino food, and like that that was their hole in the wall. It didn't. It didn't say blubber. No. Nah. Okay. It, it was a hole in the wall Filipino food. Okay. And mine is Filipino, so he's like, "Okay, I, I gotta see, I gotta judge it." How was it? It was actually really damn good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It was like one of the. It was probably one of the best Filipino spots I've I've been. Hmm. Yeah, it was. It was up there. I like that better than I like the crab leg. So. This this um, trip doesn't sound very interesting. It doesn't. Other than like missing, not not fishing, not seeing wolves, not seeing bears. I saw a bald eagle. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. That's cool. How big was it? Well, how close was it? I saw three. Did you go like this? No. Because Popsu did that there when Lando's arm. Yeah, they didn't do that with me. No. Did and you also, try it? I I need a glove. No, did... you don't need it, Pops. Oh, no, because the... have you seen their? I know Pops. Have you seen it? I know. Pops can do that. I'm, I'm not I'm not like Pop. No. Yeah, mm -mm. like that. Mm -mm. Okay. So how big was it? Like same size? Was it four feet? Five it, feet? And it had to have like a four or five foot wingspan because there were three of them. How to be bigger than that? Huh? How to be like a six foot wingspan? I don't know. I have a video of them. How tall was he? Oh, I didn't see that. Okay. And like I have videos of them. Yeah, I got one in slow mo too. Where the um? Oh, like what about the, the what about the salmon? Oh, did you catch a salmon? Oh, uh, the salmon there. That was another thing. We were at the end of the salmon season. Mm -hmm. Um, and that was uh, it's something. Okay, so I'm pretty sure like a good chunk of people have seen like what salmon do mm -hmm. okay like the salmon lifestyle the life cycle so when salmon are born they're born in fresh water mm -hmm. they're born in fresh water and um <clears throat> it's uh like they, they they're born in the gravel and then they go down the river when they're like no longer fry and then they go into the ocean where they grow up and then after a while they become fully they become a fully size like like biggest size it could be and then they go back up the river where they were born mm -hmm. so that they could go <coughs> to the lakes and find a little spot a gravel and then they uh, they lay their eggs, and the 
ladies lay their eggs and the guys they do they nut and then start the whole cycle over but when they go back up the river after they nut they just start decaying when i came there they were either a dead <laughs> or decaying and it was um it's sad because you don't see that on the on like all those nature documentaries. You don't see post nut salmon. Yeah. Yeah. But they're literally just they you look at them they they do not look good. They are not no longer they're not pink. They're like all grayish and they're just swimming around. They have not they don't eat anymore. And they just and, and like they they literally fall apart. It's it's kind of gross. Did you grab one and do that? No. Huh? No. But how do you catch one? Oh, you like you could throw your line in, and then you reel it up, and there's a dead salmon at the end, and like literally just. So that's what what Sam caught. Did they <sighs> catch dead salmon? Oh yeah, he caught a few dead salmon. Huh. So you could say he caught salmon. But, no, but how about the first one we held in hand? Was that one dead? Oh, no, those are trout. <clears throat> oh, trout. Yeah, trout are okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. But salmons are not are dead. I mean, are, are their last legs. Mm-hmm. They got the COVID. Yeah. <clears throat> and, it's like, no, dude, they, they do not look good. And you do not, you know, like, you don't see on nature documentaries how they look. You have to probably do some extra research to see how they are, but you've got to see it because it is... It looks kind of grody. Grody. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, that song, that word's from way back, dude. That's from the seventies. That's from the seventies. <laughs> I think that's from the seventies. Maybe, yeah, maybe early, early eighties. But that's an old ass word. Ah, uh, that's that is definitely a. That's a that's a word my mom uses all the time. Okay. She says grody. You just, you just like. Yeah, you just aged your mom there. Huh? You just aged your mom there. And I aged my mom. Yes. <laughs> so, uh, what else, so, so what else about um, Alaskan? But not Alaskan stuff. Oh, I went hiking a lot. We also went like, off, like they did like an off-road jeep thing. Oh, and uh, another funny thing. All the street signs. Are in Alaskan. No, they're all in English. <sighs> all in English but <laughs> they all have bullet holes in them yeah yeah nice like you can see all the fun you can see all the people that would like drive by it and then they get like the rifle and then and there are some signs that are out there and they are messed up and it's kind of funny I was like dude they do not like that sign it's not good mm-hmm not good at all. They had, to, they had to get revenge. They did something to their family or something. Oh, so, yeah. so tell us some more Alaskan stuff. <clears throat> you were there for five days, dude. Mm-hmm. We didn't talk for five days, so you could talk Alaska stuff. Yeah. So, come on. Um. <laughs> uh, I went shopping. Brought back a bit of stuff. and <laughs> got some salmon. And uh, I think some of the salmon that I brought back home, <laughs> I literally saw it <laughs> today. <laughs> I saw the, I saw it at the store the smoked salmon. I was like, oh, nice. No. Granted, they they only had the natural one. They didn't have the sockeye. So I brought you back sockeye salmon. Okay. For pops. And uh, there's some pictures of the salmon what you're talking about. Huh? There's pictures of the salmon we're talking about. Yeah. Salmon, if, uh, um, end of cycle. Oh, yeah. You can see end of cycle salmon like on pictures, but you don't see them in the documentaries. You don't see them swimming around and just literally just decaying. I think so. I got videos. There might be some videos here. Oh, no. You could find a video. But I'm just saying, like, in the nature documentaries, like the popular ones, mm-hmm. they don't show you post nut salmon. No. They only show you. Like when they're 
when they're like getting ready they're like they're when they're jumping yeah and they're getting eaten by bears oh I didn't see a bear I'm sad. there are black bears there yeah in Ketchikan. and they're vegetarian no pescatarians they are omnivores pescatarians no they're not like joe huh oh they they eat they eat everything they eat berries they eat salmon they eat like, wolves no people no black bears are like eagles a little scared eagles no Should have brought back an eagle. Brought back an eagle. Yeah. I we don't think we, we could have had it as a pet. I don't think that'll go through customs. No. No. What if you put a suit on him and say it's like your buddy? It'd be he have to be a really good actor. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. I don't, like I'll have to pretend like he's like a parakeet. Yeah. Cheep 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 cheep. No. Nah. No. I think. I think his pictures would be a little bit too distinguished. I think he's a little big. A little big. Yeah, I have to get like a baby one. They're pretty, still pretty big. Huh? I think they're still pretty big. Oh, yeah. But they don't look like eagles when they're little. Uh, like the balls of fur. Uh, <clears throat> so what else? Come on, dude. Tell us some Australia stuff. I mean, Australia stuff. Some Alaska stuff. Alaska stuff. I'm going to go to Australia. It was a whole week you were in Alaska, not sending pictures, not doing things because you wanted to, we're going to talk about it on the podcast. Oh, yeah. And now we're all waiting, all of us. <laughs> all of us are waiting for, oh. this, for this momentous occasion here for we can have Alaskan stories. No. Oh, awesome. And now we don't have any. No. I, okay. went, I went on the deadliest catch boat. Oh, okay. That's what the guy was talking about? Mm-hmm. And what happened? Um, Did they catch some deadly stuff? Uh, oh, it, it's deadliest catch. It's like the... I know. Did they catch deadly cast, catch? Uh, they caught... They caught nothing a, nothing they, that kills you. I think he caught a um, fish, didn't he? Uh, they, caught, they caught fish. No, but um, that one, the video, he said he caught a fish or something like that. Something like that. And the basket that they brought up, I think he said he caught a... There was a fish in there. Yes, they caught like the was it stonefish. I think so. Yeah, and they're like poisonous. Mm -hmm. I guess that is deadly or venomous. Yeah, this is a deadly catch. And uh, they caught um, like these. I forgot what kind of crabs they are. But I got pictures of them. What about lobsters? Um. What does deadliest catch catch? They catch crabs. Okay. They mainly catch crabs. The deadly part of the catch is that they out there. For three months or something like that. Yeah, and um, <clears throat> it's also like storms happen. Yeah. And that one got hit by like a 60-foot rogue wave. And that was uh, it's kind of wild. You could check it out. But okay. it was cool. Nice. It, it was a. Uh, it's pretty extra. It sounds pretty fun. It is pretty fun. No, it doesn't. It does sound pretty fun. <laughs> it's fun. Okay, but you haven't. You're, like, you're supposed to wow us with these stories, Alaskan stories. Mm -hmm. You know, like probably. Other than your mom and Chelsea having went to this Alaska, dude, and they don't listen to it, so. <laughs> they haven't went. To, so we're trying to figure out like how was Alaska, and you're just telling us these little uh, stories that we could have had at Lake Lake. Catching dead fish, looking at dead fish. Um, you would not see that many dead fish at Lake Lake. I'm sure. Lake Lake. Um, oh, what's no. That, other one up there on top. Oh, what's what's you, what's because if you go to Alaska, like there's literally dead fish everywhere. MacArthur Park, the lake over there. The whole, like, you can't even <clears throat> stand on, like, the shore of, like, a lot of the lakes because there's so much dead salmon. So what do they do with the dead salmon that are just there falling apart? They probably move them away, or they let them decay. They just wash away, just mm -hmm. nature. Mm -hmm. Sometimes bears still eat them. Why don't you make a documentary on this? Make a documentary on dead salmon. Yes, what they do to it. Find out what they do with the dead salmon after it's gone, and how nature, like, does the nature of life circle thing works. The circle of life. 
like just watch how salmon decay i would have to be there for a minute you don't have to go you can do it online no because then like I, that if i make it just a paper that's boring what? yeah you can see what happens huh you can go through and felt see how it works i need to put like a camera like in front of a dead salmon like a bunch you have of pictures salmon. so you have pictures already no, but like I would, I would, I would want to show what happens. I like what's happening what to the dead salmon right now? Because there's still a lot of dead salmon there. Okay. But like, I'm not gonna go back. Didn't you meet any that. any Eskimos or um, Alaskans? Um, yeah. You should got a number and ask them. Hey, uh, what happens to the dead dead salmon? Like, what do you guys do with it? Huh. I ask. That would have been really cool for our story here. Talking to the Alaskans, like, hey, uh, you could have had some more research. A lot of them don't like the tourists. They like the tourists, but I don't like the tourists. Like, they like the money that the tourists bring, but they just hate the people. Hmm. Yeah. They, maybe, maybe they should leave that tourist town then. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> but it's like, oh, no, they, they, no, it's more like they think they're all dumb. Who's dumb? Tourists. At least all the cruise ship ones. Oh, why is that? Um, they're haters. Uh, no, it was like there's one of our guys. He liked us, but he was like, "Dude, I got some dumb people that were like that were here." <clears throat> yeah, cause uh, maybe he was thinking of you. He's like, "There's some dumb people around here," and you guys were standing right in front of him. He's like. Yeah, we were there. We were there, and I was like, uh, I, I, I just said, bet. <laughs> How are they done? And he was like, oh, uh, uh, they call them, uh, they call us the, the 48 states. If you're not, a, if you're on the main continent. Yeah, we're not, they're not one of the 48. Yeah, they're not part of the 48. So, when people asked, uh, <laughs> oh, what do you mean we're part of the 48? Not part of the 48. No, no, when the tourists say, oh, what do you mean we're part of the 48? They don't, they, they don't, a lot of them don't understand what that means. I don't understand what you mean either. Alaska is not part of the 48 or Alaska no, is part of the 48? They're not. So who says we're not part of the 48? Uh, because Alaska is the 49th state mm -hmm. and Hawaii is the 50th. Okay. So that's why they're not part of the 48. Mm -hmm. So the main continent is 48. If we ever make Puerto Rico a state, then it'll be the 51st. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, so I don't understand what he was meaning by they're not. Oh, no, because they didn't know that what that meant. And then they also asked, like, oh, and when a lot of the Alaskan, and when a lot of the tourists would go over to Alaska and say, well, in the United States, we would do this. Oh. <laughs> well, that makes sense. <laughs> that makes sense? Yeah. Uh, because, like, they're donor, they forget. Huh. Same thing, like, like uh, Hawaii. Or they would, they would go, like, man, you guys speak English really well. Yeah. But if you want a Canadian, it's kind of the same thing. Canadian? You guys really speak English pretty well. Yeah. What if you go to, like, a fake British, and you go there, and like, wow, oh, you guys speak English, but you have, like, an accent. Uh. <laughs> That'd be pretty cool. Yeah. Also, they'll ask an accent. It, LA, it, it sounds kind of more like just how Washingtonians sound. Hmm. Like Seattle. They, like, I, I feel like I have a harder time understanding uh, people in, like, Minnesota. Minnesota. <laughs> You don't know? I don't know. I'm just trying to, like, trying to, I was really ready for, like, Alaskan stories. 
Uh, oh, and, and you're not delivering. Uh, you're not uh, delivering uh, also, <clears throat> it rained like most of the time we were there. Okay. Because it's a rainforest. Fun fact. Yeah. But it's a, it's a temperate rainforest, so it's not hot. It just rains all the time. And uh, that's why I was wearing a jacket, but all the native Alaskans... They don't wear jackets. They don't do that in the south either. They don't care. They just walk around and get wet. Mm-hmm. I don't know how they do that. Because we're in California, we're bougie. <laughs> we are. <laughs> we don't like the we don't like the rain. I don't. I don't. It, it, it's wet. In Florida, they're walking around, just walking in the rain, like nothing. Mm-hmm. They didn't care. No one. Well, you can't really have an umbrella because of lightning. But yeah, they didn't care. You wear like. If you wear a hat, if you wear a hat, you're a bitch. Like a hoodie, like a hood over your hat. Yeah. Like, you have a hat on your hoodie, and it's there, but you don't put it on. Yeah. You just kind of, and then walk. <laughs> makes no sense, but. <laughs> it makes no sense. But whatever. Yeah. And I think it's against a lot of work to have an umbrella. Mm. Because you don't want to walk around like that. Mm. It's not cool. Uh, yeah, it, like, if you have an umbrella, you're a bitch. Yes, I think so. Yeah, that's kind of how it was. Oh, however, I had the beanie on mm-hmm. with the light on it. Mm-hmm. They thought that was cool as hell. They did? Yeah. Is that the one I gave you? Yeah. Oh, nice. At least it got used. Huh? So you walked around the beanie with the light? Yeah. Okay. I, I forgot to charge it <laughs> until the last day. Sweet. <laughs> but when I had it on, they were like, oh, shit, that's so cool. I need that. And I was like, yeah, it's cool. Okay. I don't know if I could get you that, but... <laughs> Amazon. Yeah, I guess they could get on Amazon. Yeah, next um, day shipping. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Come Prime members, that'll be good. Mm. It should be because, like, every like a lot of the international shipping, it um, it goes to Alaska. Fun fact: the Anchorage, mm-hmm. uh, Anchorage, Alaska airport. It is the third most popular, like, airport in the United States. And it's the number one shipping airport in the United States. Nice. So, are we going to get any better with these uh, Alaska stories? Because when we're talking, when we first came back, you were like, oh, man, I got, like, this Alaska story. Like, oh, man, this Alaska story. So then we stopped talking for a whole week. Yeah. So we talk Alaska stuff. I know. And you're like, oh, this is gonna, this is, I, I got this, and I can't even tell you anything because Alaska, Alaska, yeah. Alaska. And now we get here, and um, you're done 35 minutes into the Alaska stories. Yeah. And 20 minutes of it, you weren't really talking about Alaska stories. So you need to like either look at your phone, your your pictures, then you can probably figure out oh, then you like reflash some memory, because dude, your dementia is horrible right now, dude. A lot of the, I'm going to be real, a lot of the hype died because it's been like... That's what I mean. It's not hype died because no, we haven't heard it. Oh, but the We've died. been waiting. We've been waiting for this. Yeah, but the hype died for me. No, tell us about it. Like, look at your pictures. Like, oh, yeah, I remember this. Oh, you should have seen this. I like, You already, like, failed with the wolf. You failed with the bear. And you failed with the um, elk. Oh, technically, there was a bear outside of our room but we weren't there so i wasn't there huh so i wasn't there no it was chilling outside of our room did you see it no but then it wasn't there that that bear wasn't there dude Mm -hmm. but yeah somebody told me there was a bear out here in the front of my house oh really yeah but i didn't see it yep oh i had i got crawfish oh actually i had some of the best Clam chowder. So, oh, like, so did I. In the, but it was like, no, it wasn't clam chowder. It was salmon chowder. Okay. Um. Literally in the woods. In the woods. Yeah, like you know how. Uh, what what <laughs> we go make today? Yeah, what we go make today? Yeah. That guy, he, like how he cooks, how like how he cooks his cornbread. Yeah. That that's how they made the chowder. Like out there, just in a bowl, 
Uh, like like in a big old pot. Good as hell. And now I'm just thinking, dude, just food has to just taste better when it's just cooked outside. Think so? Yeah. I don't know. <clears throat> Thanks for the pictures. I still want to hear more pictures. Oh, and um, a lot of the like lakes and rivers there are all um, black water. Black water. Mm -hmm. Why? There's a lot of trees. Mm -hmm. So um, when the trees shed their leaves, it goes into the water and then... Um, creates algae? No. Um, creates, the, creates leaf water? Yeah. And like, it was, the, the scientific term is... Uh, uh, like the the tannins just go and sink to the bottom of the water, and then they decay inside the water, and then it darkens it, and the water looks really cool. You can't see shit. Oh. But um, there are like a lot of people that make fish tanks, and they have like dark water tanks. And after like looking around, I'm like, I want to make a I want to make a dark water tank now. It's gonna mm. be dope. Nice. Mm. Cool. <laughs> That sounds so great. <laughs> you're, Jeez. You, yes. you, you just sound like you're just a hater, dude. So, yeah. <laughs> what else do we see in this um, Alaska trip here? <laughs> it sounds so fun. I, I, I'm, I'm just, oh my God, I don't know what to do. This, this, I'm so excited. Like a whole week for Alaska stories. Mm-hmm. No, I think the issue is, is that you're saying we have been waiting, waiting for these Alaska stories. We have. They were they were waiting for Alaska. <laughs> but like, I, I think since I had a delay, me talking about Alaska, you now overhyped it. How we overhype it? When we first were talking, oh, dude, this, and then I can't talk about it. Oh, this. You had like 17 things we're going to talk about. No, because like, and like when I would do it, like it was cool at the moment. But now, like, I already did it, and I was like, I have to re-remember. I was like, that's cool. But, like, if I told you when it was... We'd be, we'd be pumped. Mm -hmm. All of us would be pumped. Yeah. Also... Like, all, um, our, all our listeners, we have probably, like, a thousand, and they're waiting. <laughs> probably a thousand. They're, like, waiting. We're all waiting. On pins and needles. Like, oh, like Jordan's, Jordan's going to say, oh, dude, Alaska it murdered it. Like, oh, it was going to be so good. Yep. Yes. But it's like, he, he probably went and touched a uh, bear or something, like hung out with the bear. Nope. Played with an eagle. Nope. He rode on an uh, elk. Nope. Seen mooses. Nope. No meese. Dude. You just sound disappointed. Yeah. Did you at least eat elk, Nick? Did you at I least... I did not see an elk. Did you eat elk? I moose? Ate, I did. You ate, ate elk and moose? No. No what'd moose. You, what'd you eat? I, I ate a lot of fish. Okay. Oh. That's another thing. Okay, here comes another. The way over here comes. I forgot. Boom. I, I have presents for you. I know that. And I forgot them all. Yeah, we forgot about that. It's fine. <laughs> we understand that. Like I got a, I got a whole, like a little. Um, yeah, a whole ass piece of fish. I do got a whole ass piece a of fish. A whole ass salmon, dude, for me. Got Thank a whole God. ass salmon for you, and I also got you. Um, I got you your magnet. Oh, of course, you got a magnet. I always get a magnet everywhere I go, and I got you a deck of cards. What kind of deck of cards? It's got like um. A magic deck? No. How am I supposed to play magic if you didn't get my magic deck? It's it, it's a normal fifty-two card deck. But does it have does it have Alaska stuff on it? Yes, it's got a lot of Alaska stuff on it. It's got it tells you like all the different um, like types of mushrooms that are there, and uh, did you do um, mushrooms? Did I do mushrooms in Alaska? Yes. No. Why not? I should have tried it. You should have tried, like, um, psilocybin or the toad or something, dude. You should have tried something. Yeah. Then you could have came back and do what had real stories instead of these nut stories that we have right now. Oh, I... Like, they have weed in Alaska. You smoke weed anyways, but it's different. Yeah. I'm talking about, like, 
like so you can like open your mind and see the future because i was in the future you weren't no i was in the past i know i was in the future when you were in the past yeah you told me there were flying cars in there yes <laughs> then i came back there were no <laughs> flying cars you didn't see him no <laughs> oh dude i was in the future and there were flying cars and um <laughs> and we're living on there were people living on mars no, no? and you came back and you didn't see it no nope. man i must have been a little farther in the future than i thought mm-hmm yeah it's coming it's coming it's coming but <laughs> it's about to be there <laughs> no because i'm back in the future no no you're in the present i'm in the present i was in the future <laughs> See? Yeah, it's the future. you're in the future all the time and then there were flying cars and people living on mars so when you go to new york it'll be like i'll be the back of the future again uh-huh you think the apocalypse if you go to new york is the apocalypse gonna happen i'm gonna find out next time mm. when i go back i actually am gonna go back in the future in a couple of weeks but not mm. all the way in the future just partly partly in the future uh I think that's one of my favorite memes is um if uh if uh england was truly our ally why didn't they warn us about 9 11 because they're 12 hours like they're like eight hours ahead yep they didn't know and they didn't tell them nope that 9 11 was gonna happen it's messed up yep a lot of ones are messed up you know why mm-hmm because it happened farther in the future. So they didn't know. They knew like two hours later or four hours later. Oh. See? Because the people who did it were more in the future. That's true. They are farther in the future, huh? See? <laughs> or, oh, but I, or, I, or the people who did it are, are in the past already, so it already happened, and they didn't know. They forgot about it. No, like... Inside no. job. Inside job was done from here, so it was already they already passed that. No, because like in Australia, they're like they're a day ahead. Yeah, we'll see. They would they would have known. Huh? They might have known. Yeah, they don't worry us either. Well, they weren't worried about. It. They're down the bottom. They're down under. That's top stuff. They ain't worried about top stuff. Mm. But they're our ally. Yeah, but it'll go past them. It'll fall off. Mm. No, no. But that was my last story. That was it. We're done with Alaska stuff. Damn, dude. Yep. That was so fun. I played magic in Alaska a little bit. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. Yeah. Uh, Alaska sounds amazing. I think I need to go. Yep. Yeah. You make us really want to go to Alaska and just see um, uh, dead fish. Yeah. And you didn't have all like the didn't have all the like the full dead fish thing. You had like a couple of dead fish stories. Yeah. I hope everybody likes this. Because <laughs> you, well, cause you, you like really, you went out of your way to go like go somewhere and then come back and just tell us the, those adventurous stories. Mm-hmm. Some hiking. Yep. Didn't say anything about hiking because you didn't say anything. And then um, jumping on a boat. We, we just hiked a lot. Big boat. It saw a lot of trees. Yeah. Actually, but they're not like, the trees here are actually bigger. Than the island, yeah, because because it's not it's okay. Go ahead. Because since it's an island, mm-hmm. um, the top soil is a lot shallower than yeah. here, so like the roots can't get that deep. That's deep. That's deep. Yeah, so the the roots branch outward instead of down, so uh, you could just like. Like, like the bigger trees, like you, you, you can like trip over the roots, like even though you're far away from them. Is it um, is it uh, fresh water or in salt water? Like, is it surrounded by fresh or sun, is it surrounded by fresh, or does it s- fresh go through it to make the island, or is it salt water? There's a lot of fresh water in the island, but it's surrounded by salt water. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, like, cause. When you're, when you're like there, mm-hmm. there's a lot of cruise ships that would come by, and they go through the salt water. Did you sleep in an igloo? Igloo? No. <sighs> Did you see an igloo? No. Saw totems. Nothing. I saw saw legit totem poles. Totem poles. No igloos. Mm-hmm. 
there are like certain things you have to see when you're in Alaska, Alaska things. It, there were no glaciers because we're too far south. That's why I said it's like, it's like beginner track Alaska. So we need to go where's back. Your, where'd your mom and Chelsea go? They went to actual Alaska. They went to Anchorage. So they seen Alaska things. Yeah, they went. They saw glaciers. Mom, they went on a helicopter tour and uh, saw that. But they didn't go on hikes. So they called you a bitch. No. They seen moose, meese. I don't think so. They seen elk. Nope. They see an eagle. I don't think they did. They see salmon. Definitely not. Two disappointing stories. <clears throat> Disappointment, everybody. It's like when I go to Jordan's house, pass by somewhere, it's a disappointment. This is like the same thing. <sighs> I don't know, everybody. <laughs> I don't know, everybody. We're just going to... Um... You know what? We're going to end it there. Thanks for coming. Thanks, Jordan, for um, those great stories of uh, Alaska stuff. Well, that... I think they're all ready. So, so okay, go ahead. So now we got. That's why I was like thinking, we gotta go back. Oh, I gotta go back now. Yeah, cause, well, I need to go back with you. Okay. Because your friends are boring. No, we went hiking. It was fun. Okay. But when we go, we're probably gonna go to like hardcore Alaska. Hate ourselves. Why am I gonna go to hardcore Alaska? It's cold. Yeah, but you want to go see the mises. I wanted you to go see the moose and play with the elk and to touch the bear. Yeah, but we got to do that now. Why we? Because you got to go to Alaska. Maybe Pops needs to go do that. No, you need to go to Alaska. I need to go to Alaska. I need to yeah. go to Alaska. Why? Because. That'll make my 50, 50? Yeah. Oh. You haven't hit all 50 yet. Oh. You're missing Alaska. No, I don't, I don't think I'm going to go. I'm going to leave that off the list. I'm just gonna leave it. Mm-hmm. I think I'm gonna leave that off the list. Mm. I'm good. Or you could go to Ketchikan. Go to Alaska Light. I know, dude. Yeah? We'll work on it. We'll think about it. All right, everybody. Thanks for coming. Uh, 24 Slayton. All <laughs> platforms. All platforms. Uh, yeah, we're. we're uh, it was great. It was the, um, the most. Incredible stories we ever had today uh, <laughs> on Northern Jordan. We've been waiting like a long time for this, and I'm I'm really happy that we had this opportunity to listen. So, uh, um, yeah, make sure you check it out, like and subscribe, uh, Jordan. Yeah. Alaska, Alaska uh, local now. Uh, Alaska local. Watch us on all platforms. You know, we're on YouTube. We're on. Uh, we're actually on Prime. Well, we're on Prime now. Prime, yes, Prime. Okay. Amazon. We're on. Uh, um, 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 Apple, we're on uh, Spotify, we're on all those stuff. So, like and subscribe, check us out, comment. Jordan, Tim, Alaska Local, we're out. <laughs> Alaska Local.